Hey guys, on this video I'm going to show you how to make pan style pizza like you'd find at Pizza Hut with a crispy crust but it's thick and it's gooey and it's soft. First thing you're going to need, here's pizza that I made today or pizza dough. Okay, see how nicely it's risen. Now you can go to the store and just buy yourself some pizza dough. You don't necessarily have to make it yourself. Um, it'll work either way. Okay, second thing you're going to need is a pan that can go in the oven. See how this is made of metal? Well, that can go in the oven. We're going to put the pizza in here and fry it. Okay, that's why Pizza Hut pizza is so good because it's fried pizza essentially. So we're going to fry it in here and then put it right in the oven. I'll show you how. So let's get right into the pizza making process here. So I have a cutting board, put a little flour on there. I'm going to grab a big old hunk pizza dough. Now while you're doing this, make sure that your oven is being preheated at 450. Okay. So I'm not going to mess with this pizza too much. I just want to get it into a nice round shape. I'm going to probably post the recipe for the pizza dough below in the uh, comment section of this video. Okay, so this is a nice, light, fluffy pizza dough made with yeast. All right, and like I said, I'm not going to mess around with it too much. This is done. So what is our next step? So our next step... You want to get a pan and heat it up. Okay, I have this on a gas burner so it's nice and hot. And I'm going to put a whole bunch of olive oil in here. Okay, so if you notice, see I'm actually coating the whole bottom of the pan. And then the pizza dough is going to go right in. Okay, carefully you don't burn your fingers. Alright, and right away you can tell that this pizza dough is frying. Okay, you're going to see it puff up. Now while this is happening, I'm very quickly going to put my toppings on the pizza. So I'm going to take this nice tomato sauce that I made. Okay, it's pizza sauce and I make sure that it has a lot of sugar and a lot of salt. Okay, if you're going to do this and you want it to taste like Pizza Hut pizza, you definitely want to put the sugar in there. Alright, so we got our tomato. cheese, nice mozzarella cheese, and for this one you can put whatever toppings you like. I'm going to do pepperoni. And you can see this pizza is getting nice and puffy. It's rising. Okay, some nice peppers, some onions. All right. Okay, I'm going to turn my stove off and I'm going to pop this right in the oven at 450 and it's going to cook just until the pizza looks like pizza. So 20 minutes. Okay, so pizza is out of the oven. This pan is super hot. You know, make sure you use your oven mitts or you're probably going to learn the hard way like everybody does. All right, so we get a nice spatula here and pizza out and there we go look at that I'm gonna let it cool just a little bit before I slice into it so this is basically what you're looking for a nice crispy bottom and a nice soft gooey moist top that's what I love the best about Pizza Hut pizzas and all pan fried pizzas okay so let's uh, I can't even wait I don't want to wait for this thing to cool down I want to cut into it like right now okay I don't know if you can hear that crunch, but it's beautiful. And if you don't have a large chef knife, you can always just use a pizza roller. Look at this beautiful slice of pizza. Look how nice and thick and soft and fluffy that slice is. Super crunchy on the bottom. That's your Pizza Hut style pan fried pizza right there. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please hit that subscribe button. Your subscriptions help keep this channel alive and they help me make more videos. And if you like the videos, please give the video a like. I would greatly appreciate it. All right guys, thanks for watching. See you on the next video.